Hi, I'm Sam Seal. I've been a real estate broker for a long time now. And I've got a question for you today. Here's the question. When is three and three quarter percent interest actually 67 and a half percent? You know what the answer is? The answer might surprise you. Here it is. The answer is when it is your mortgage loan. That's exactly the truth. Let me show you what I mean. I did an amortization schedule based on one of the best interest rates I can find today. And that rate is a 3.75% or 3 and 3 quarter percent rate, 30 year fixed mortgage. And I took an example of $200,000. Here's how it breaks down. Your monthly payments on this $200,000 loan at 3.75% are going to be $926.23. Now that's just principal and interest. There's no additional figures in here for taxes, insurance, and the such. But here's how you really figure the true interest rate. Very simple. I ran an amortization schedule so you can see what the numbers are. So out of this $926, $625 is actually interest, $301 is principal. So what's the true interest rate? It's very simple. You divide the interest by the total amount paid to get the true interest rate, that is the true amount calculated on the money that came out of your bank account or came out of your pocket. You know what that figure is in the first month? 67.5%. If you go down 12 payments or one year, you will have paid out a little over $11,000 in payments. $7,437 of that is interest. You divide the interest by the payments, you come up with 67%. You carry this down through 30 years, and here's what you find. Yes, in 30 years, if you didn't do anything else, you will have the loan paid off. The $200,000 is now paid. You will have paid $132,356 in interest. Total monies paid out of your pocket will have been a little over $332,000. You divide the interest by the total paid, and you get the average interest for those 30 years to be 40%. All of these interest rates are nowhere near this illusionary, deceptive rate that is advertised to us every day. The actual, true and actual interest rates are glossed over today and many, many people are not even aware of how high those rates really and truly are. That's what I call the magic of uh, compounding numbers the magical banking system that the bankers don't really want us to know about. And here's some more irony to this all. You start out with a loan of $200,000. Now, here's what that loan really represented. That loan was only a debt that was created on paper. A debt that was a computer entry created from absolutely nothing at all. In order to receive this debt, you signed over an asset, your house, something of tangible value. Yet, we are all paying astronomical usury, is really the proper term and word, interest on money that was created out of absolutely nothing at all. Maybe now it's easier for you to see how the bankers, how the private Federal Reserve, how the international bankers have gained so much money and so much power over the years. Because this system has been going on for decades. Yes, decades. Imagine this system multiplied over the hundreds of millions of people, okay, for the decades and decades it's been in existence. That's why the world is in the situation it's in today. You know, Thomas Jefferson once said this. Give, I'm going to paraphrase this to the best that I can. Given the ability 
to make money, a private bank is no different than a standing army on a people's liberty today. It wasn't exactly quite right, but it's ba but it went pretty much similar to that. That's exactly what's happening today. So how did I find out about this? I woke up a couple years ago. I started to really awake after going through this on a rather large condo development project that I did. And I, I came in contact and became part of an international organization that is committed to empowering people and educating people unlike most people have ever seen before. I invite you to do the same thing that I did. Go to my website, wealthpeace.com. Click on, it's in the description of this video. Click on there and watch a short video about your money, about our money. Put your email in the box, get some more information. And perhaps I'll see you on the other side. I invite you to join me. Thank you for your time. I'm out for now. Sam Seal.